What's up everybody? So this past summer I got the chance to visit an amazing place called the Forester Underground Gardens in Fresno, California. Pretty much it's a series of living corridors, patios, and beautiful garden spaces that spans over 10 acres all of which are underground in order to avoid the heat waves of Fresno summers. The entire place is inspired by the Roman catacombs and was built over a period of 40 years from 1906 to 1946 by a Sicilian man named Balasar Forrester. Balasar spent pretty much most of the hours of his day excavating the area to create this place where he not only lived, but hoped that someday it would be a place of relaxation and retreat for those trying to escape the Fresno sun. Balasar's story began when he came to America in 1901 with the hopes of becoming a citrus farmer. He bought land in Fresno due to the low price of said acres with the hope that he could grow and sell fruit to make a living. However, he soon realized that the ground on his new land was covered with sedimentary rock, making it impossible to plant. Add in the heat of Fresno mentioned earlier, and on the surface, the land that Balasar bought was practically useless. That is until he had an idea. Slowly he started to carve the rock on his land into living spaces using a pick, a shovel, and a wheelbarrow. He was inspired by the catacombs from his hometown of Filari, Sicily. Balazar was a self-taught artist. However, he had done some work on railroad tunnels in his youth, which gave him the knowledge to construct his home. That said, the gardens were made with no official blueprint. Rather, Balazar created the place step by step. Neighbors and other locals thought Balazar was crazy. Thankfully, though, his brother Giuseppe lived nearby and would help Balazar from time to time. Fun fact! There's actually a large bell at the entrance of the gardens that Giuseppe and anyone visiting Balazar would ring in order to let Balazar know that they were there, since he basically could be anywhere on this massive property. Eventually, all the years of hard work would take a toll on Balazar's body. He had developed a hernia from lifting all the rocks and was noticeably weaker. On November 10th, 1946, Balazar would pass away at the age of 67. At the time of his death, he was in the process of adding a parking garage to his property. Yes, a parking garage. And a dance hall. His brother would inherit the land, and per Balazar's wishes, he would finish the dance hall, which today is often used for weddings and local events. After Giuseppe's death, the city of Fresno began to build businesses and roads around the garden. As a result, parts of the landmark were destroyed. Thankfully though, Giuseppe's children were able to help petition for the rest of the land to be preserved. The Forest Deer Underground Gardens were designated as a California Registered Historical Landmark in 1979. Today, the land is overseen by the Forestier family. The place is truly a gem, with awesome tour guides that take you throughout the garden and explain the history of each room. I highly recommend if you're near the area or looking for something to do, that you go and check out the Forestier Underground Gardens. With all that said, let me know in the comments section below. Have you ever been to the gardens? If so, what was the coolest part about it to you? And as always, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button as well as the subscribe button below so you can stay up to date with all my latest content. Peace.